Good morning, grade 7 children. It's your ICT, sir. Welcome back. Uh, most of you have uh, found it a di little difficult how to write your first HTML coding in the book rather than in the computer. Okay, let me just teach you step by step what you should do. Take a time. You can rewind, pause, and learn how you do. How do you write in, 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 in letter or in practical way rather than typing it in computer. Okay, let's go and see what the picture is all about. Here is your mother's love. And it, it contains a Two paragraphs, two pictures, and two headings, and a simple color. Now I have I have told you. I have told you that um, I have mentioned that you are to use the following tags to construct the the web page. So you you should use HTML, bold heading head img for images title for the title h1 and h2 and paragraphs you have two paragraphs you have an underline an italic font color there is a font color over here can you see it's red color And few of these words are little bold. If you can see, it's little bold. Mother is the mother is responsible for the well-being of a society. So you you should use a bold, an italic. Right, it's italic. So let's go and see how you do here. Yeah. The color is being, being a purple. I think it's a purple color. There is an underline here. Women's are inherently good mothers. So let's go and see how you do that in, in a book. Right, children. Let's imagine this is your book and you are ready to write your first HTML codings. So what are the first basic tags that you should do? Yes, you should write HTML. Open HTML and keep space and write your Closing HTML. Next, what must you write? Yes, the head. HTML head close, and then you begin with the title. Title 2 has an ending, end tag. So, what is the title uh, uh, that is re uh, shown there? It's Mother's Love. So, in between the title open and the title close, you write Mother's Love. Next, what is the next tag? The next tag is the body tag, yes, body and I told you make sure that the body is, body close is before the closing of HTML over here, right, good. 
Now you have done one. Few, few uh, basic codes. And if you see the color of the, uh, the body is it seems to be pink color yes so let's write that down right body bg color equals to with the inverted commas what do you write pink so imagine that you have uh, you are writing typing in a computer just write it in your book as it is then it has become pink next you see a paragraph is it a paragraph a heading mother's love so this is heading number 2 h1 and this is h2 here you are now I have written, I have typed H1 opening and H2 close. H, sorry, this has to be H1. So in between H1 and H1 close, you can write. What is that? The heading is what? Mother's love. Mother's love. So you have completed that. What's next? Next is a paragraph. Before you write a paragraph, make sure that you use a tag called font color equals to what is the color? Uh, it's purple, I suppose. Let's go to the uh, to your book. So. What's your first tag? What is the first the tag? Font. See. Uh, color equals the double quotation mark in between. Right. Purple. And then remember to end the font tag. Ending of the font like this way. And in between, now you can open the next tag. What is the next tag? It is about the P tag tag and the p tag close right children under the p tag you are to write the complete sentence about what i have written about the mother's love mother's love so the paragraph opens and end of the paragraph complete paragraph is written over here. You just write this down and then this paragraph is over. This paragraph is over. Next is the picture. Let's go and see how you write that in your book. Now you can use the IMG tag and the attribute SRC equals what is the name of the picture that you are referring to the two pictures that are given to you is mother and a kid since this is the mother and a kid I think it's a child mother and the boy this is mother and the boy and mother and the kid so you can write this complete name over here so it is mother and the other and the kid dot jpg so let's go and see how you do that in your book img src between right mother and the kid i just copied it so you should know by now um, 
this has to be now mother and the kid dot jpg and close the bracket and then the image will display right over there but there is another thing that you got to learn that which I have not taught you if you see over here there is a black border around the picture so there is another attribute for that it is called do you see a black dark border you can write this down you can write the attribute called border equals maybe the the, the width of the border is and I just put 3 so the border equals 3 you're done then the picture becomes according to according to uh, the picture seen here the dark border you will get next is about the importance of the mother and it has a font color as red so let's go and do that also right I made it easy for you to quickly do so font color I'm going to make this as red font color is red and let's close the font tag close the font tag in between the open font and the close font I'm going to open another H2 tag so H2 open and H2 close you can write that down in your book like this H2 and what is its uh, heading write the importance of a mother simply as that ok so that task is also over next you have another paragraph over here it doesn't have a color so you can just write another paragraph over here over here let's write the next paragraph p tag and the p tag close in between the open and the closing p tag let's enter the contain what is the contain you got to write all the details that I have written there okay children here is the contain I have written the contain quickly and the paragraph is over now you can see the paragraph is over but there are some things that I have got to teach you how do you make this bold underline uh, bold and italic and how do I make this underline I'll come back to you and there is another bold here can you see it's a little bold dark right the next tag is the next the final tag is I mean the next tag after the paragraph is another picture over here with a, a thick border so let's go to my word and you should write image src mother and the boy now this time is mother and the boy dot jpg border equals 3 that's all you have done that also okay the next is how do you make this 
the mother is responsible to make this darker and italic. Let me show you using the U tag and the B tag. Very simple. So the starting of the B and the U is the. So let's go to your let's go to your work book. Where can we see that? Right, here we go. The mothers the mother is responsible for the well being of the society. Up to here it is bold and italic. So you can use first the B tag the B tag and close the B tag from here BB then it becomes bold next you can use after B the I tag for italic and over there you can use I close I Tag. Then you are done. It will be bold and it will be italic. I hope you got that understood. Next, next, uh, you got to make women are inherited. So over here, up to mothers, you are to underline this. Let's go and see in the document. Where can you see that? The next, the first paragraph. Okay, children. I found where it is. Woman, from here to here. This should be under, uh, underlined. So come here. Open the first tag of you. Underline. Open underline. So it becomes, it starts to underline from W and it will end over here underline cross so complete word until it's full stop it will underline did you understand this now I think you have completed your first HTML writing in a book rather than in a computer. Now if you copy this, if you have if you have this in your computer, you will get the following HTML similar to this. I hope you understood this, children. If you have a doubt, please write a comment in the WhatsApp group. I'll help you. Thank you. Have a nice day. God bless you.